Hey, what's going on, guys? Old Hell Rod. I'm bringing you a new crazy XP money unlimited sale. Awesome for you new players. Go visit the Glitch Zone mining Big EC's community. First thing you want to do when you spawn in on Red Dead Online is have a posse formed. Then hit progress, go to story missions, land of opportunity. Then go down to kill them each and every one. Really? Kill them each and every one. Then hit replay mission. Then you'll spawn in the screen to pop up the posse leader, which is me. I'll hit start mission. If you hit the start matchmaking, that means other players are going to join in and they ain't going to want to do this shit. But it, it, it's really OP. Now, as soon as you both get this screen, hit triangle to ready up. As soon as you ready up, you know you go through all these loading screens. Just hold the X button to skip them. Just skip them. But what's killer about this, you can get all collectibles, everything. As soon as the screen goes through, that little yellow dot, which is Horley, let his ass go on. You guys get on a horse. Get, it's faster for us both to do this. And just ride the hell away from him. Right away. Now on this, you can get all collectibles. All collectibles. And when you're done with this mission, when you've got enough money, and you've got all your collectibles, and you go finish the mission, you're going to get gold and everything on top of it, plus XP. But, make your ass back to a poker table and reset everything, and you can redo it again. And I'm just showing you that all collectibles are in this. You can get all collectibles. The only thing, there's no friggin' animals. There's fish. Can't use your fishy pole. I'm going to show you how to get past that. Ride your ass all the way up here at Blackwater. This is the best spot to get the sturgeon. Pull out your fishy pole and they'll spawn in. But have your bow and arrow and small game arrow. I mean, this is the best spot. You see how close it is. I can just wait out and pick it up. I didn't get no collectibles until I made my way back to Horley. Then I picked up all collectibles. Or you can just ride around and get all you want. I mean, it's no big deal. You play the game how you want. I'm just telling you how I do it. Now, while I'm over here to butcher waiting on Damnation, I'm going to run in at the damn wardrobe. <coughs> Excuse me. Got up, went, go take a pee, let the dog out, whatever. Just sit here while he's getting his ass over here. Then as soon as you see, yep, he's back. Go in and out, in and out, in and out. You probably don't have to. I need to try that. You probably don't have to. <coughs> and get the glitch working. This is very simple to get. It's 100% consistent. The best out there. You can't do it with a Northern Pike. I've tried. Well, I've tried and it wouldn't work, but I'll try some more. But hey, you're losing, what's this, 725? You're losing 75 cents. So. But you'll come out after you get out of the wardrobe, stack that son of a bitch about three times. And I'm going to show you how both of you can s sell and make money instead of one sitting there selling and then the other one just standing there with his, around with his thumb up his ass with nothing to do. So now you both can make money, then hunt collectibles and finish the mission and both get gold and XP. That ain't counting the money and the XP you're getting from all the collectibles and whatever. Now I'll go over after I stacked it and sell it and you'll see fish is there. You can hit this every time. 100% consistent. And you want to sell at least once or twice to get the glitch going. And I'm going to show you how to get your buddy started to sell. Little catch. Little catch. Nothing big. Very simple. Okay, now that fish is glitched. Now, Damnation going to get on his horse... And right away until the fish falls off my horse. That's the key.
Now you'll see he ride away. I cut a lot of the video out. He rode away, keeps riding, ride till he gets far enough, then this fish should fall off the horse. And if you got a party chat going, you just tell him, say, hey, fish fell off the horse. Bam, he's far enough. Fish fell off. You can't pick it up. Let it lay there. See how it sucked on the horse? It still thinks it's on the horse. So it's glitched. He comes back. He does the same routine. Gets off his horse, run into the wardrobe, waits a few minutes, in and out, in and out, in and out. Then he'll come out, stack the fish. Give him a few minutes. The boy's a little slow. Now you see he came out. I cut the video, but he stood in there for a few minutes. Which I really need to test if you need to go in and out of there. I need to test that. Anyway, he's going to take it off and stack it about three times. OCD. And if you're a low level man, this would kick ass. This would kick ass. Insane XPM money. You're not just standing around disconnecting or none of that. You're also sitting here stacking his fish. So what? It's 725. Boom. It's money, ain't it? It's better than one person standing around and doing it. And he'll sell. Boom. Fish is glitched. He'll do it one more time just to double check. And I, I'm sure I'm going to hear it like I always do. Oh, the trader glitch is best. Yeah, it is. But trader glitch has turned into bullshit. You'll help somebody do that trader glitch, and they won't help you. That's the biggest problem. That's what I always hear about. That's why I don't post it on my channel. It's that simple. Go visit Big EC and give him some love. We worked our ass off on this shit. Now, you see his fish glitch. He's going to come over and pick your fish up and put it on your horse. Because the fish is still glitched. You just can't pick it up. Till now. And he'll go back over here and stand. And when you're selling, somebody has to be outside the butcher. As you'll see. You know, when you go into that sell screen, your horse fades out. You fade out. Okay, somebody has to be standing out. I'll take it off. Stack it. Sell. Back out. Boom. Glitch complete. Complete. Both of you can stand here and sell as long as you want. It is 100% consistent. Like I see, I'll show here with Damnation. If you ever get to slow ass in gear, that boy needs a disability check. I swear to God. He'll take it off. He'll put it on. And he'll go over and sell. Sorry for the long video, but I just want to put as much as I can out there in the info. I don't even like making long videos. See, he sold it, and I was standing out. That's how it's got to work. Now, he's standing out. I'm going to go over and sell mine. Take turns. Stand here all day make money. 100% consistent. But like I said, when you get done doing this, you both got enough money. I'll show you. Both of them glitched. Now, I was over here getting collectibles, but now you want to ride all the way back down here to Horley. On your way back, make sure you got the collector's map. That way you can pick the collectibles up on your way back instead of when you're going to Blackwater. I wished it was closer, but it's not. But there's, an, there's more to come. Now, when you get here and start this mission, blow all their asses away. You'll get cards, liquor bottles, stuff like that. Then when you get close to the end, both of you run in here and just stand here. Just stand here. Let them blow your ass away. Kill you. You'll respawn right back in. You'll do that a couple times. Respawn on, spawn in. Boom. Then when both of you get killed again, it'll say restart at checkpoint. It'll start all over again. So that's endless XP, money, boom, gold when you finish the mission. When you're done, had enough, and finish the mission and go into free roam. Take your ass back. To the poker table and reset all the collectibles and do it all over again insane but that's it sorry for the long video but hit that like button hit that notification bell and subscribe